Hi, everyone. This is Cindy Soto, your certified health educator from the Hippocrates Health Institute and the author of the guide, How to Get the Most Out of the Program. I'm joined here by my husband, Pedro, who is one of the health educator instructors for the Institute. Today we're interviewing Dr. Brian Clement, the world's leading expert in raw food nutrition. As director of Hippocrates Health Institute for over 35 years, he has gained his vast knowledge from experience. Before we go to Dr. Clement, I want you to be aware of a great opportunity for you or a loved one to do the three-week life change program with us as part of a group. In addition to saving hundreds of dollars, you get some other great benefits. For more details, please visit www.hippocratesgroupsavings.com. We have groups scheduled for the rest of this year. For the exact dates, visit www.hippocratesgroupsavings.com. Now let's get to the questions with Dr. Brian. Come in, I think he's in Belgium, wants to know, what does someone suffering from severe idiopathic gastroparesis that's not related to diabetes need to do? Maybe well, we often, use, we often use uh, two methods in this. We use water that's first purified and then alkalized so that the hydration is part of the problem with this. What has happened is that you've had a gastrointestinal breakdown of the system. So the hydration factor doesn't allow the organs to flow and operate and function in the rhythm that they should. Picture a drum head when a drum stick hits it. How the sound comes out is a vibration. If we don't have enough hydration in cells that become organs and systems, we don't have the vibration and usage factor of this area. So hydration is very important. First, purify water, because alkalizers do not purify water well enough, and then you put alkalizers on it, and that's number one. Number two, depending upon the case, and the case we figure out through medical tests and and, and, and records that may be available, et cetera, then we target specific Chinese herbal medicine to it. As a matter of fact, about 30 minutes ago before this, this call, I went in and I prescribed to one of our guests that are here who have a very similar problem to you, Chinese medicine that I, I, did, I brought in from China, but actually discovered in Toronto, Canada. It's been extremely successful. Like 89% or 90% of the people we're giving this to are having brilliant, brilliant results with it. Thanks, Dr. Clement. And thank you, our listener and viewer. Please take a moment and leave us a comment. Did you like it? Did you hate it? Whatever you're feeling about what you just heard, let us know. Thanks again. And until next time, here's to your health. 